Hello everyone and welcome to SOP Academy. In this video, we are going to see the Vipro NTH that is the National Talent Hunt exam pattern as well as the syllabus. So first we will be looking at the pattern of the NTH. Then we will move on to the syllabus for each and every section. After that, we are going to see what are the best resources, the best material to prepare for the National Talent Hunt for free. And at last, we will see what are the further rounds that is after the assessment, what are the further rounds that you are going to face. So let us start with the pattern first. So in NTH, you will have five sections overall. The first section is quant, second is logical, third is verbal or English. These combined are known as the aptitude section. So this is the apt section. Uh, you can expect 52 questions from apt sections and you will get 48 minutes to solve these questions. So for quants, you will have 16 questions and you will get 16 minutes. For logical, you will have 14 questions. You have to solve in 14 minutes. For the English or verbal, you will have 22 questions and you will have 18 minutes to solve them. So this was the apt round. These three are known as the apt round. Then you will move on to the coding round. So in coding, there are going to be two questions. One question is going to be a pretty easy question and the other one will be a bit difficult than the first one. So two questions, you will have one hour that is 60 minutes to solve these coding questions. And the last round is going to be an essay writing section. So essay writing, they will give you some topic on which you will have to write an essay. So there will be some word limit so that you can, uh, you have to write uh, the essay in only those word limits. Then uh, there is going to be one essay and you will have 20 minutes to write that essay. So uh, one important point is that you will not have any no negative marking. So there is no negative marking and about the cutoff. So there is no sectional cutoff in Wipro. There will be an overall quota. So to be on the safer side, if you have greater than 70% or equal to, so if you have equal to or greater than 70%, then you have high chances of getting the interview mail. So try to get at least 70% score to be on the safer side. Next, we move on to the syllabus. So first we will discuss the quant syllabus. So for quants, these are some of the topics through which uh, the questions can come. First is LCM HCF. Next is divisibility, numbers, decimals, fractions and power, time and work, pipes and cisterns, averages, profits and loss. Uh, other topics are simple and compound interest, time, speed, distance, inverse, problems on trains, geometry, coordinate geometry, clocks and calendars, logarithms. Then permutation and combination, probability, ratio and proportion, algebra, certs and indices, allegation and mixtures, problems on ages. So these are some of the topics uh, from which questions come can come on quants. The next is logical reasoning syllabus. So for logical reasoning, expect questions from coding and co coding deductive logic, blood relation, directional sense, objective reasoning, selection decision tables, odd man out, statement and conclusion, analogy and classification recognition, coding and number series, then sitting arrangements. The other topics are mathematical orders, inferred meaning, logical word sequence, data sufficiency, syllogism and data arrangements. So this is the syllabus for the logical reasoning. The last FT section is the English or verbal. So for English verbal, uh, the topics are synonyms, antonyms, jumbled sentence, then sentence formation, inferential literal comprehension, contextual vocabulary, comprehension ordering, error identification, sentence improvement and construction, subject verb agreement, tense and articles and preposition and conjunction. So this was the apt section. After you complete the apt, you will move on to the coding syllabus. So for coding, uh, you can do programming in C, C++, Java, Python, any uh, language you want to prefer. So you can choose there. Uh, the topics, the main topics you can expect are questions from strings, then question from arrays and matrices and searching and sorting. So this is the very common topics, these three. And you can also expect questions from stacks and queues and linked list. So overall, uh, most of the questions will be coming from these topics only on the coding syllabus. If you cover these topics, then most of the questions you will be able to do. <coughs> Moving on to the next, that is the preparation resources. So the links for all the resources will be given in the description. First, I will discuss what are the websites uh, to prepare for uh, which syllabus. So from India Vix, you can prepare the aptitude. Uh, you will find the quant section, logical and the verbal that is the English section. All the three sections, questions for each and every topic you can find here. 
the second one uh, is for the coding so for coding if uh, there are going to be two cases if you know programming from before then directly you can move on to uh, this website that is Vipro coding questions uh, this is from prep insta so you will find previous year coding questions here you will see Vipro coding question one two three four there are going to be many questions uh, which have appeared in the previous uh, Vipro nth exams so you can directly move on to the coding questions if you know programming from before but if you are new to programming and you want to attempt the coding part so first you go to the w3 schools uh, then click on tutorials when you click on tutorials you will find the languages different languages suppose first you have to select which language you want to start with then suppose i want to start with c++ click on c++ so you will find each and every topic discussed in detail so first complete the tutorial for that language after that you can move on to the Vipro coding questions. So this is prep insta. This was W3 schools. You can also uh, use geeks for geeks for doing the coding questions. So on geeks for geeks, you can find topic wise questions. Suppose you want to see C++ questions. So for C++, you click on C++. So on geeks for geeks, you can see uh, there are various questions available. So, uh, suppose this is one of the questions converting string to number and vice versa. You click on this. Uh, they will give you the question first and then they will also provide you with the solution so use geeks for geeks w first start with w3 schools complete one programming language first then do some programming questions from geeks for geeks uh, and attempt the Vipro previous year questions and then at last when you are done with all the three then you can move on to hacker rank so on this platform you will find uh, various coding questions uh, for different various exams and you will also find coding questions uh, on each and every topic in the syllabus so you can at attempt questions on hackering there are uh, numerous questions so if you are done with all the three then you can move on to hack rank and attempt a uh, different questions so after completing the nth assessment uh, if you are selected you will get a business discussion round that is then interview round so there, so there is only one round of interview in Vipro now so that is that is known as the business discussion round so after you qualify the interview round you will get the LOI and after that the offer letter and joinings so this is the full process of the NTH from starting till the end I discuss the pattern then sex uh, the syllabus for each and every section and I also provided you with the uh, preparation resources so the links for all the three websites that is the preparation resources will be given in the description you can go to the website start with the uh, to practice and then you can give attempt the NTH uh, so for the interview round uh, if you clear the assessment then you can subscribe to our channel so we post interview experiences of different companies you can see we have uh, Infosys interview experiences Capgemini interview experiences TCS interview experiences so pretty soon we will be uh, rolling out some Wipro interview experiences as well so you can subscribe to our channel and you will find the interview material so that is all for this video. See you soon in the next video.